I think the project is about transparency. There's been this idea, the general idea of objects having left Africa and, 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 and Kenya specifically and more broadly Global South to move northwards, to move into these large stores um, and, and permanent exhibitions, to be presented sometimes in ways that dishonor the people that the objects come from. For me this this debate is uh, more like a human rights issue uh, because it's not just about the absence of those objects, but the way in which they left. Um, it can be problematic objects. It can be objects that left in difficult circumstances. It can be objects that were coerced away from the people. It can even be objects that could have been bought fair and square if anything that happened during the colonial times can be labeled as fair. And so bringing them back uh, is just writing wrongs that were committed uh, several years ago. Uh, uh, while a good number of objects have left uh, in a more friendly way, in proper manner, uh, we are talking about researchers who came, did their research, talked to communities, bought objects in open market. Now, those ones are okay. Those I mean, objects can, can stay wherever they are. But we have a set of objects that left under question of the circumstances. They were stolen, uh, they were confiscated using uh, state power, uh, colonial state uh, enterprise. Um, the things that we became much more critical about are not the justice questions. We are like, justice is so simple, you know? People are trying to make it so complicated and use all these big words, restitution, repatriation, but it's like you took something that wasn't yours, bring it back, that's it. And if you look at all the injustices of this world, they are as simple as that. You shot someone who shouldn't have been shot. You, you, took, you, you took money from people who were poor. Like, it's simple. It's almost like childishly simple. Like, you could tell children about these things and they'd be like, that's not cool.